Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. Today I'm going to be giving you guys a guide on basically gameplay for NBA Live Mobile, how you're going to be able to score, how it's going to be easier to beat a lot of live events, and uh, the only thing that you got to get out of this is get somebody with really, really good three-pointer. Um, things like going in the paint and shooting like a lot of layups and a lot of dunks will get blocked very easily in this game. So uh, it's really important to have a really good shooter. So I use Isaiah Thomas or Kyle Korver or Karan Butler. They're all super good and not incredibly expensive players. They're about 30k right now as this video is being made. So 91 speed and he's got 88 three-pointer on that Isaiah Thomas. Uh, my elite Isaiah Thomas you can get in the impact. It's kind of difficult to complete the set. But um, over here, I got Karan Butler, uh, throwback with 87 three-pointer, I believe. And then I don't even, I think I might have just taken Kyle Covert out, but I know he's a beast. So you can just trust me on that one. But I'm going to go hop into season game, just show you guys exactly what I do. It's, I mean, it really is just run down, chuck up a three-pointer run back. But um, a lot of you guys were saying you were really struggling with gameplay and you were getting beat by the CPU on season mode. I did lose one season mode game. It's because I left autoplay on for too long and I got beat. But uh, other than that, it's been pretty It's been pretty easy. And Blake Griffin gets right past me. But that's what I mean. Like, right there, that seemed like such a basic layup. And in, like, 2K, anybody would make that layup. But right here, he just missed that. So I just stick to doing that the whole time. Dwight Howard's going to grab my rebound. I'm going to kick this out, and I get him jumping. If you get him jumping, it's basically the only time I'll take it to the lane. So if you tap the shoot button, it'll go up like this, but he won't actually shoot it. You guys probably know that, but if you don't, there you go. And uh, that's about the only time I go in the lane. And right there, Chris Paul just chucked a lob, which isn't something that we can even do. That's so irritating. I hate when the CPU can do something that I can't. Like, like in Mad Mobile when the QB scrambles and I can't even scramble. Either way, uh, I pretty much sprint down, chuck up a three, get out of there. So so two straight bricks right there so i'm not I'm obviously not showing it off too well but um there i mean the most i think i've scored in a season game is like i think 75 or something where i i was just checking up threes they're all going in so uh that's how i've been doing it right now it's not working out too great but isaiah thomas with his great speed like he's already i mean like the cushion that chris paul is giving me is like pretty much a guaranteed point so right there's two points i guess i stepped on the line but Nevertheless, he made it. It's kind of it's kind of boring sometimes just doing that. So sometimes I'll switch it up, but uh, it lets you get that achievement for three pointers really easy. I don't know if you guys saw that achievement or have done it, but um, JJ, how did JJ Reddick make that shot? Uh, either way, that achievement gets you a lot, a lot of coins. It's 100 three pointers in a season, and I believe it gives you um, I believe it gives you a pro pack and like a certain amount of coins. So that that'll definitely help you get some of these players if you don't have any of them, but. Right now I'm chucking up bricks, but I nevertheless it's gonna we're gonna be good. Dwight Howard down to Hayward. Hayward's got a pretty good three pointer as well. Oh, let's see if we get the buzzer beater right here. He's gonna beat the buzzer. Ah, there we go. There's our three points. All right, works. 0.5 seconds left. He's gonna chuck it up and hopefully miss. Oh, thank you. Thank you for not hitting a buzzer beater on me. All right, so I'm gonna continue. I think I'll just play one more quarter. I don't want to like bore you guys to death, but uh. Just let me know on def defense is pretty basic. You can, uh, I don't try for steals out, out in the backcourt because it pretty much never works. But when they stop dribbling kind of like this, that's when you can, boom, wow. I did it perfectly right there. That's when you can get that steal. I'm going to stop, pop, and drop it. Hit that boy. Hey, there we go. Three points. Candid for Isaiah Thomas, 15 to 6. So he's doing correct. He's doing correct. Wow, what I just say? Oh, another steal. Gordon Hayward, rip squad. Isaiah Thomas hit it. Hit it. Stay hot from deep. Oh, that was too deep. If I had taken one step in, that was wet. That's whatever. That's whatever. They got Mbamute. DeAndre Jordan with a, the ugliest hop step I've ever seen, but he gets his own rebound. Whatever. I'm not even mad about that, though. Like, if you're going to put up some trash like that, I don't even care. Hit it. Hit it, Isaiah. Isaiah Thomas hits it. Another three points. There's 18 to 8. Got a 10-point lead going into the second. Let's see if we can let's see if our, we can keep our hot streak alive. Like right here, I don't even mind if like Blake Griffin goes in the paint. There's no way he's making that. Like that's that's such a trash shot. And that's what happens when you go in the paint too. Like if I go in right here, I uh, yeah, I just got ripped. And he threw it to this guy who was out of bounds. So I got lucky right there. But uh, I I mean honestly, I try and stay out of the paint. Another good shot is to uh, pump fake at two point range. If they don't jump, just take it. And there you go. I think uh, mid-range jumpers and three-pointers are a lot smarter than uh, just going in the paint and getting swatted 24-7. So uh, it's it's doing it's doing well right now. And there, Chris Paul's going to drive in. He's going to miss. We're going to get the rebound. We're going to go take a good quality shot. DeRozan, can you put a move on him? Ooh. Ah! 
Ooh, that was actually a pretty good move. I might have been able to take that right there, but we're just going to take that spot up jumper with Haley misses. That's all right. We're shooting a good percentage right now. Uh-oh. 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 Random white guy in the lane. He's not going to get a bucket. Uh, Howard over to... Can we try Hayward for the three? Can he wet it? Let's go. Gordon Hayward's got it. So uh, I try and have at least two guys that can shoot a three. I have throwback Dirk, I think, on one of my lineups. And he's got really good three, and he's a power forward. So that's always fun because you'll get some, like, really just really tall, really slow guy on you. So you can kind of just dribble around him and then go get a wide open three. So I really like that card, too. But Dwight Howard's going to get a dunk here. Let's mm, lay up whatever darn it dunking is kind of difficult it's all about timing there's no specific dunk button you just kind of got to get lucky with your timing but oh chris hall is gonna hit the buzzer beater we got 25 to 10 i think i can play another quarter though we're doing pretty well i'll take it into the next quarter so 25 to 10 i'll see if i can put up i'll try and put up 60 i'll try and put up 60 on him i know that's not like a ton but we'll see what we can do <laughs> gotta get more rips though Gotta get more ribs. Oh, that is great passing, and Imba Mute doesn't take it up the first time. That's gonna result in too bad for him. Dion, Blake Griffin, you are like one of the best dunkers in the league. You should tomahawk that right on his head. Uh, okay, whatever. Whatever. Uh, some people have told me the best way to get a dunk is by um, starting to slide up when you get to the uh, that little uh, semi-dotted half circle, and Chris Paul just dunked on me, and then uh, like ending your slide once you get to the charge box, if that makes sense. So like that dotted half circle, you start your slide up right there, and then you try and finish it before you get to the, um, the charge box, but that's whatever. Looks like Blake Griffin's backing off a of Hayward. Can he take it? Ah! No. Let's see if we can get somebody jumping on a pump fake. There we get the other Griffin on jumping on a pump fake, and he slams it right in his face. Dude, he got the nuts facial right there. When you when you hang on the rim and they just show... Oh, Blake Griffin, rib squad. Let's go. Jeez. Griffin's got the hustle right now. I can appreciate that right there. That's, that's legit. All right. Hayward, let's pass this ball around. Let's get something rolling. Ah! Or let's just chuck the ball. Oh, he passed it right into Dwight. Dwight. Dwight, you soft ass pussy. You need to dunk it on something. Well, honestly, though, that's Dwight Howard. Like, that's just how Dwight Howard plays. I can't blame him. They probably loaded, like, soft ass pussy into his player so that he won't dunk on anybody. It's, it's probably part of his card. Shit, 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 shit. And I kicked it. Whatever. 31 12. I don't know. I don't know if we're on our way to 60, boys. I don't know. But we can try. We can always try. Here we go. Hey, we'd rip this boy. Hayward ripped this dude. Oh my god, that, that was such an easy rip. Howard's got the big boy boards. All right, Hayward, I trust you on this three. Let's go. What? God. It's too easy, dude. It's too easy. But this is not like 2K. Just because you get that plus 10% on the green does not guarantee you're going to make the shot. So uh, keep that in mind. I know in 2K, if you get that like flashing green bar, you're guaranteed to make it. Which is kind of a weird concept if you think about it. Like, it's an 100% shot if you, like, time it right. That's kind of... That's whatever. Oh, and I say Thomas did not hit it right there. That's a perfect example. That was a plus 10% right there, and I did not hit it. Let's go. Rip him. Rip him. Oh, get that out of here. No. Baloney. Oh, can we get it up for the buzzer beater? Isaiah Thomas? Oh, darn it. All right. We'll take it into the fourth quarter. I'll actually do a full game of gameplay right here 34 14 we're doing pretty well we could be doing better we could we could be making a few more threes but let's try it straight up run down that left side of the court chuck up this three and just wet it let's go was that a two darn it that was a two ball two balls have a i mean not necessarily but two balls tend to have a little bit higher percentage chance of going in though because it's not a three duh um oh get it <sighs> out of bounds whatever whatever 36 14 you can't do you can't do the cheesy um just like steal it from the inbounds pass like you can in 2k and fadeaways almost never go in you can fade away just by shooting and pressing away i'll try one right here that's a fadeaway and oh my god off the glass that was a garbage shot but it's gonna go in for us so hey i can't complain two points is two points it's just gotta go in the bucket it doesn't matter how it goes in the all right, why is J.J. Redick the MVP right now? You got Blake Griffin, Chris Paul, DeAndre Jordan, and J.J. Redick is just tearing me apart right now. And there's that wet-ass three. Let's go. 41-16. How much can we drop in the fourth? Come on. We need rips. If we want to drop a lot. Of what? How is? How are they throwing lobs? I want to throw a lob. 
I'm, I'm pretty... Let me know if you can, but I don't think you can throw a lob in this game. At least not yet. Uh, that would be sick, though. If they can if they can somehow coordinate that. Oh, come on. Oh, Griffin gets that board. I guess they were sleeping on that one. Ooh, make a move. Ooh, that's a that's a big boy. That's a big boy bucket right there. Lefty lefty hook shot from Blake Griffin. That's unorthodox. Chris Paul's gonna take a jank three-pointer. We're gonna get running. Hayward's gonna pick it up. Hayward's gonna pick it up. Get down to the side. And he's gonna wet the three. And he does wet the three. I'm the plus four percent. I love it. 46, 16. Got 50 seconds left. I want 60 points. I want my 60. I'm not gonna get it. Maybe I should just let them score. I didn't mean to let them score right there, but I should just let them score so I can keep getting the ball back. It, even then, though, they would go in the paint and just miss. That's how this. That's how this game is sometimes. Isaiah Thomas, another three. 49, 18. Let's keep it rolling. Come on, Isaiah. Rip this man. Rip this man. Rip this man. Oh, he was right in my arm sockets. Come on. Jeez, Chris Paul is just pulling up from everywhere right now. He's got that pull-up game strong. Get it? Because pull-out game, but but, but, but it's not pull-out game. Oh, step back. Step back wet. Jeez, Isaiah Thomas is lighting it up in the fourth quarter. We don't have much time left. I don't think we can hit 60. But Chris Paul is going to wet his shot right here. Isaiah Thomas. Isaiah Thomas, do your thing. I believe in you. I believe in you. Hit it. Hit that three straight. Three straight from Isaiah Thomas. Jesus Christ, this man is on fire. All right, we're pretty close to our 60. If Chris Paul misses this, get there. Get there. Somebody get there. Shoot it. No, Dwight's not making it. I'm 100% sure Dwight's not making it. Oh, 55 to 20. The Dallas Mavericks are going to take the win on probably... I, I don't know if you can check the stats. Can you check uh, box score? Oh, darn it. They don't have box score. That'd be pretty cool if you could check your box score and you could see how your players did. But um, nevertheless, an excellent game by the Mavericks. That's basically what I do to score. Oh, wait. Okay, you can check how many points you scored per quarter. Or no, it just kind of adds it up for you. That's kind of interesting. Okay, we scored 13 in the second. We scored 9 in the third. And we scored 21 in the fourth quarter. That's pretty sick. That would be 21 all four quarters and then 84 if we had kept that pace. But nevertheless, guys, that's basically how I play. I, I just do it like that. So if you guys were struggling, maybe try and just kind of do it like that. I've, I've never had uh, much trouble. Sometimes I have trouble with the NBA Supremacy Live event. But I just force close out if I'm like totally losing and then I play it again. But uh, three-pointers and uh, mid range jump shots those are your go-to's definitely i mean you can try and go in the lane going in the lane's fun and getting dunks but uh if you're really trying to win or do good on head to head layups you're gonna get swatted a lot so that's just how it is um but i'd say that's about it for now ladies and gentlemen thank you so much for watching as always